up guys welcome back to the channel uh, today's video is about all the tools that I use to maintain my beard so let's get started um, if you ever seen any of my previous videos I'll go and get these out the way um, and this is my Scotch Porter beard collection that includes the beard wash now this is the beard shampoo that makes my beard feels clean and whatnot and what I like about these products it doesn't have any sulfate and it doesn't have a, like a real smell to it so um, it makes my beard feel as clean as possible without putting any other products in it or any other things that my beard doesn't need inside of it. So, it leaves it, as it said on the bottle, it leaves it soft, smooth, and silky. No lie. All right. So, next up is the Scotch Porter Beard Conditioner. Now, I love the Scotch Porter Beard Conditioner because it makes my beard feel so, so soft. Now, I don't listen because the Instruction says to leave it in your beard for two to five minutes. I do seven minutes because I need the extra softness to my beard. I just want I just want my beard to be so soft. If a random stranger came up and was like, "Yo, I give you a hundred dollars to let me touch your beard, and if it's as soft as ever, you can keep it." Okay, cool. Touch it, touch it. Oh my God, it's so soft. So yeah, that reaction I just did. This will give it to you. This right here, you know. So after after I. Dry my beer out with a towel or whatnot. I go ahead and put this beer balm in. Now this beer balm, I love it because it makes my beard moisturize, but it doesn't put too much in, but just enough to give it all the hydration that it needs. And then I put this beard serum in that gives it the shine that it needs. Bam. If you don't know about Scotch Porter, I have a link in the description for these products as well as every other, uh, other item that I use in this video. So let's get to the next one. The next are my beard tools. That will be the Afro pick. It would be the Kent comb. And we have beard brush. Now, all three of these tools have different purposes. Um, the beard Afro pick is used to get the beard to a natural state, as you see right here. Now the Kent comb, I use that to shape my beard. And you notice with the Kent comb, I'm not combing down. Like I'm not using, the, I'm not combing down like this. I'm actually put the teeth of the comb inside my beard and I'm combing down like this. So. Yeah. And I like to do that when I'm shampooing my beard or condition it because it trains my hair to go that way so it's not that many knots not that many kinks into it and it just goes with the flow and the beard brush lays the hair down and also when I'm putting my scotch porter beard serum in it actually spreads that around the beard to any spots that it hasn't so it gets that nice shiny look that it needs Okay. Next up is my beard trimming tool. So I started trimming my beard about two years ago, a little over two years ago by myself because I got tired of Barbara just cutting my beard the way they wanted to. I got tired of them boxing it. I got tired of them trimming off length. I got tired of them just doing whatever they wanted to. I'm like, you know what? So let me hop on YouTube, see how everybody else do it or see how barbers do it and I'll learn from them. And I learned from BeardTube. I learned from Nico Versace. I learned from... 360 Jeezy, and all, all of them taught me how to fade. They taught me how to either fade the hair or they taught me how to trim my beard. And so I was like, once I learned the fundamentals of how to fade, I was like, okay, I can actually fade my own beard, my sideburns, you know, I can trim this down myself, and I can make it look as nice as possible without me having to pay somebody to screw my beard up. So I have the wall magic clip. That's the trimmer that I use to fade. And the guards that I use to fade are the, see, the one and a half guard, the one guard, and a half guard. So all these guards have different purposes. I use the one and a half guard to trim the sides of my beard and to trim my beard. I'll go ahead and use the one guard to actually trim the sideburn down 
and I use the half guard to actually fade that my sideburns, you know. And I love the fact that these are cordless because I don't have any cords that are um, that is getting in my way. I remember when I used to have to look in the mirror and have all the cords this way, and I'm like, man, this is almost like, what am I doing? But with this, it makes it so easy. I just get straight to the point. I just. go ahead and just pick I'll use the afro pick to pick up my beard and I'll go ahead and trim the beard up with the guard on of course I don't want to do it with the guard off because I'm not trying to mess this up this is like a, the best gift I ever received I don't want to mess this up you know and with the wall cordless tattoo trimmer with the wall ty blade on it I just use this to like I said put the line in Line up the the beer bridge. I call it the beer bridge. Also, get under the neck. You know, get the neck. Cause this would be a problem if you if you don't take care of it. You know, and then I take like little hairs from the edge of the beard that grow out too much that's it for this video uh, that's all the products that i use i really hope that this helped you guys out and until next time thank you for taking the time out of your day to check out this video feel free to like comment share to your social media platforms and also subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell so you never miss any content that i drop you take care and have a good rest of your day